Columbiana County commissioners have a controversial issue that they're being asked to decide. It's whether or not to allow developers to build a huge solar energy facility on farmland in the county. As First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti shows us, a hearing on the subject drew a big crowd this morning. A large crowd greeted Columbiana County commissioners to voice their opinions about large-scale solar energy farms. The technology is not there to produce enough electricity to justify coming in and destroying everybody's properties. Commissioners are considering whether to ban development of new solar facilities. A number of those in the crowd don't want to see that happen. We hold fast to the right to freely acquire, use, and dispose of our property. The proposed ban on a solar facility would take away my right concerning the use of my property. Presently, a Canadian firm known locally as both Algonquin and Liberty Energy is looking to develop a thousand acres in Franklin Township for a large-scale solar array. Officials say the project would take land equal to 400 football fields. Many of the opponents in the crowd wore matching t-shirts to show where they stand. We're here because we plan on shutting this project down and we don't want any new solar companies coming in here with more bad ideas. Although developers of the Algonquin Liberty Project are now before the Ohio Power Siting Board in Columbus waiting for a ruling on their request, a number of other townships in the county have asked commissioners to ban these projects in their communities. Although no one from the company attended the meeting, commissioners admit they'll need to hold at least one more hearing to accommodate other townships requesting bans. At this point, officials can't say when they'll take a vote. We need to start thinking about the future of our land. In Lisbon, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.